Yeah, we're gonna. This this oh this cost me thirty five bucks. Thirty five bucks, no fork, nothing. As is, got it from a, a clearance warehouse. Thirty five bucks. It's next warranty frame. It's missing that little thing there, which you can get you know, get one up. But thirty five bucks, man. It's just it's my god. I hate these frames laying around. Thirty five bucks, Australian. So what's that in US? Twenty five dollars USD. You mean X warranty frame? Because of that, popped off the rivets. You mean? Otherwise, just, what, what, what would happen normally? The shop would just step on that, crunch it, send the photo to Canada, and they go, "No worries, chuck it in the bin. We'll send you a new one." But for some reason, this one got—it's going to get reused. This is—I've got some group set just sent here. Facebook Marketplace. This is why I love Road Disc. Love Road Disc because of this. Some lemons off the tree. Lemons here in Australia, ten bucks a kilo. All right. And I got these for free. So I mean, these organic lemons, really, really good variety. It's a heirloom variety, but people wouldn't pay for them because they look weird. But these are incredible. Squeeze them, on some of veggies, a bit of salt. Tastes beautiful, beautiful. So here we got about a kilo of lemons. That's ten bucks saved there from the organic shop. Got them for free on a footpath tree, and we're good to go. Got some rebel whopper stuff here, bit of, bit of stuff in here. And this is what we got here: Shram Red Group Set. Just bought off a guy called John. Thanks to the John, great guy, super friendly. He upgraded, I mean, upgrade, it's a downgrade for me, but other people, it's an upgrade to road disc. And uh, one of the comments, he's like, I'm surprised how heavy my disc brake mic is. I was like, yeah, man, this stuff's super light. But anyway, people want the new stuff, that's fair enough. That's fair enough as a, a cap from an ampule, um, while the test. And this is a SRAM Red. And this is in pretty good condition. You know, the the pulleys, they're not they even cracked. Often these pulleys crack, but these ones are still fine. You know, and the pivot where there's not much slop there at all. I mean, this that feels pretty tight. It hasn't. It's had a few little scratches here and there, but nothing too serious. So yeah, we're good to go. Shifters. These are off the Super Six. These might have even come off this bike at one point. Imagine, imagine that. They'd be pretty rad, random if it actually came off these bikes. But these were a uh, special OEM for Cannondale for the Super Six uh, in this colorway and a black and green one. And it's got cables as well. I even got cables, and the cables are in good condition. So I appreciate it, John. A few scratches there, so no worries. But again, this is, you know, people wouldn't use this stuff really because it's like, oh, it's old stuff. But this is lighter, lighter. This is lighter than the Tour de France SRAM Red, the current SRAM Red Axis that you saw in the Tour de France this year. This stuff's lighter. This is lighter, and it cost me three hundred twenty-five dollars Australian. You got the titanium cage Gen One SRAM derailleur, which is a little bit faffy iffy. Um, it's got some normal wear and tear. It's actually good when it's got this much wear because it helps, you know, shave off a little bit of extra TI there. So it just makes the adjustment even easier. Which again, people are oh, scratched. It's scratched on them on that. So yeah, this guy, he advertised a group fit set for three seventy five Australian. I'll give you three hundred now. In the next thirty minutes, I was nice about it. He's like, oh, how about three twenty five? Said no worries, it's a deal. And so went around there, jumped on my e bike, rode over, good to go. He even got Swiss stop pads on here. These look even quite stock pants, you know. Um, incre they are, I think these are stock pants, maybe. Damn. These are the Gen 1 brakes, which are pretty light. Very light, actually. Lighter than the current ones. Uh, some spare hoods there. Just give them a clean up. These are brand new hoods. Just a bit dirty for being in the garage. Now, no question I've got here. Will these absolute black rings fit this BCD? Let's find out. Let's uh, first of all weigh these things. Hopefully this ground's level enough for us. It's a bit windy out the front, so I'm filming at the back here today. All right, so we've got 461. Where's the left-hand crank? It's in the all lead. And we've got chain rings as well. You gave me chain rings, man. You know what I mean? What a legend. You gave me some near new chain rings. Like, damn. And, oh, and a bottle. Oh, yeah, I forgot what else we got in here. We've got a SRAM red cassette. A little bit warm. We'll give it a clean up. These, these are like, you know, 500 bucks brand new. It's 11.28, so still got a little bit life left in there. Give it a good clean up, come up good. I'm gonna put this on the bike I'm building up at the moment. And we've got a, one of my favorite bike brackets is a SRAM ceramic. It's hardly even been used, man. Like, it feels so smooth still. But again, because it's got those scratches on there, oh, I can't use that, people like that. You know, it's hard to sell something like this. Oh, it looks a bit shabby. Yeah, it looks a bit shabby. <laughs> but it's so smooth. I love ceramic bearings. Not that you need them, but they just feel smoother. Are they faster? Probably not, but they feel smoother. 
And this is the black box, Shran black box. Bro, I reckon it's one of the best bottom brackets out there. Um, you know, in terms of like off the off the off the shelf. Obviously, you got your your sea bears and your hambinis and you know boutique stuff like this. But in terms of just like a generic bottom bracket, these are worth like when they're worth three hundred bucks or something. I really love this one. These red ones, I'm like, oh man, that's just, I love it. It's also got a washer in there. Um, make sure you put your bottom bracket on the right side, etc. Okay, so let's weigh these. We've got a drip above our heads from some clothing and. We're gonna drip it up here. So, hello, we're talking. If you appreciate these videos, give it a thumbs up. If you don't, give it a thumbs down. And uh, we're gonna weigh them up. 460 plus. And this is the group set. Um, this guy here, James Hung. He's a very experienced bike reviewer. Sometimes is quite critical of stuff in a good way. Uh, but yeah, James is generally definitely uh, probably one of the most, in terms of bike reviewers out there. James would be one of the you know, most honest of his opinions. Obviously, he has to hide stuff because he's paid to buy various things to say stuff, but otherwise, he's, he's generally pretty good. Um, but that's, you know, so James gave it a four and a half back in the day. So it's a great group set. A bit pricey, but top end group set. 1400 British pound in Australia. Let's have a look in AUD. That is 2600. So I got today for $325 Australian with extra chain rings with a uh, couple of extra spare hoods. I'll, I'll chuck a $20 chain on there and they're good to go. But yeah, that's the deal there. So SRAM Red Group Set, have a read. What James, uh, from yeah, he, what he said about it, and stuff like that. It's, yeah, it's definitely, uh, it's lightweight stuff, man. It's, it's lightweight stuff. And the shifting is incredible. The shifting on this stuff is better than the ETAP, and I know, because I've got ETAP. It's better than Axis, I know, because I've ridden Axis. Uh, it's just incredible stuff, you know. It's just, and this this cassette, man. Oh man, these cassettes are just so good. A little bit noisy sometimes, but I don't know. They just, they just they feel really good to ride. Uh, but they're very expensive, very lightweight. So there we go. That's the that's the brakes in that one. And uh, fantastic. One of my probably my second favorite group set ever, behind Shram Red Me uh, Mechanical Twenty Two. And if you want fast shifting, the Di Two is hard to go past. But in terms of weight weenie stuff, this stuff is the second best you can get. Um, and the 11 speeds, maybe just maybe 50 grams lighter total, give or take. Beautiful stuff.